historical, if you want one word, two word landmark. Fenway Studios is actually two things. For one, it's a building that was built in 1905 for artists to provide good studio space in the city of Boston. But it's also a community of the people who are here now as well as the ghosts of all the people who've been in this building in the past and worked here. And I think both are equally important. Without the building, you wouldn't have the community. And the community strives to keep the building here in good repair and available for the next generations of artists. We certainly influence each other as, as artists and neighbors. I feel the influence of my colleagues all around me. There's a lot of room in that space for all of us to communicate and share ideas. It's an incredible resource to be here. Prior to 1905, Artists worked in scattered buildings around the city. One of the buildings went up in flames and the artists were without anything. They made an appeal to patrons in the city to come to their rescue and find, help them find some kind of studio space. And then this building was designed and built in a year or a little over a year, which is amazing to me, based on the Paris ateliers of the 19th century. It's an arts and crafts style building in the heart of Boston and basically the last one left in the country, still built for the purpose of being an artist studio and still being used as an artist studio. All the studios have 14 foot high ceilings, 12 foot high windows. We turned it into essentially a national historic landmark in 1998. Well, that right away puts us in a category by itself. And that's when we were able to start applying for some grants to restore masonry and other work that was desperately needed. And we're still doing that. Still masonry work being done, there's still new windows, money raised and then installed, and a lot of work going on to keep the building good. Boston is a wonderful city. We're lucky to be in Boston, but also Boston is lucky to have this building. Our Fenway Open Studios is our annual event where we're open to the public. We've been doing this for a long time. I think it's important. We're opening our studio, our soul, our spirit. It's a great thing, actually. I think Fenway was the first for doing a, a full-fledged open studios, intentional, invite everyone in for free. So it's really a time to share uh, what we do. And it's fun to talk to them because the cross-fertilization can be really intense as they're talking about what they're doing and how they see something reflected and you go back and forth and it's just so much fun. It really is a community of like-minded people. Since moving to Fenway Studio, I feel that I have achieved something that I have always dreamed of. It means a lot. I'm proud of it, actually, to be part of it. Fenway Studios is home.